hello everyone in this video we'll discuss about the linear model of communication well there are three main models of communication linear model interactive model and transactional model in this video we'll discuss about the linear model linear model of communication is a one way process of communication which means that it is not an interactive way of communicating sender plays a very important role and sender is an active participant and receiver is a passive participant it is used for mass communication and there is no concept of feedback this is how the linear model of communication looks like here the sender will encode an idea into a message and then sender will choose an appropriate channel to transmit the message to the receiver now receiver will receive the message and decode the message but receiver will not provide any kind of feedback to the sender this is one of the drawbacks of this model as there is no feedback so it becomes quite difficult to identify whether the communication is successful or not and there is another factor that is noise noise is responsible for failure of the communication no noise could be a physical noise or a psychological noise it could lead to in, uh, interference and interruption in the transmission of the message to the receiver now these are some examples of linear communication watching television listening to radio reading a newspaper or a book so here the sender is sending the message through an appropriate channel and receiver is receiving the message and decoding the message but receiver is not able to send the feedback or reply to the sender so this is how linear model of communication works this is one of the simplest models of the communication thank you